All right, we got Annie. Annie, come. Good job. Yes. Wow. Okay. Let's see if I can zoom out. Sometimes it doesn't let me do that. I don't know why. She's not really interested in leaving me too much. Annie, come on. Good girl. Okay. Yeah, good job. Yes. She's wearing her e-collar. We're conditioning that. It's in my hand. I'm not using it. I'm probably just going to put it away. Um, people walking around. I haven't really seen the dogs yet. Okay. <clears throat> just getting her comfortable to, or with, coming into my space. I want her off exploring and having a good time. Sniffing all of those things. I'm waiting for her to kind of move away from me. And I'm just creating a little bit of a wheelhouse as far as how far away she can move away from me. And then I just call her back into my space. There's someone over here walking. Annie! God! Sit! Go ahead. Down. Stay. Stay. Good girl. Walking away. Good. Good girl. Nice. Come on, go sniff. So, like, she's staying with me, and that's nice and all. But I really want to get her comfortable with moving away, doing something that she finds valuable. Out. Thank you. Um, and calling her away from something that she finds reinforcing. I think that's what, I, that's what I'd like to work up to. Um, because it's pretty easy to call her to me when, you know, there's not really any conflict. Um, so I brought her here to Bandy Field. I have her on her long line just because there, it states everywhere leashes need to be on. Um, so it's my backup even though I'm not <laughs> holding the leash. Um, but I want to get her working with me when there are distractions and competing motivators. Annie! Come! Yes, good girl. So like that, like she was sniffing. Again, not the ultimate reinforcer. Maybe if she saw another dog or an animal or something like that, you know, that's what we obviously want to recall her away from. Um, it's a nice quiet day. It's a little bit earlier in the morning, so there aren't really those temptations. But honestly, it's fine for her first time being here with me that she's just having these mild distractions where we're having a lot of success. So again, let her wander off a little bit. Do it one more time. Annie, out, come, good, yes, very nice, oh, I can't find my snacks, so I haven't used my e-collar yet, which is nice, okay, um, it's there if I need it, I'm okay with using it, I want her to know what that means and how to respond to it correctly, um, so I'm probably gonna do one where I do use it even though she doesn't need it, just to make sure that she's responding properly, so right here, Annie, come, yes, good job, so I use the e-collar there, same picture. She looks exactly the same. Oh, these are hitting your ankles. I'm sorry. Um, but just giving her that information so that she's understanding how to remove that pressure source and um, successfully coming back to me to get all the good snackos. All right, girl.